I'm your family personal chef, Mike Moses. This video is for adults only. I use my juicer a lot, mostly for nutritional drinks. However, sometimes I like to make a mixed drink. And the mixers I use are the ones that I make. And I've got all the details for you coming up. If you like this video, please don't forget to click the thumbs up icon. And if you like more of these, please subscribe. If you're going to indulge in some debauchery, why not make your own mixers? Not only are they healthy, but you know what's in them. No preservatives, all natural ingredients. Maybe a margarita with fresh limes and oranges. How about a tequila sunrise with your own grenadine? Here's what we'll need. For our margarita mix, we're gonna need two thirds of a cup of orange juice one cup of lime juice, one third of a cup of simple syrup, a teaspoon of orange zest, two teaspoons of lime zest, one half teaspoon of kosher salt. To make your simple syrup, it's easy. Two cups of sugar, two cups of water. For the screwdriver mix, two cups of orange juice, one and a half teaspoons of kosher salt. For the tequila sunrise mix, two cups of orange juice, one teaspoon of grenadine. So what we're going to do here is make everything from scratch. That way, we know what's in our mixers, and the freshness will elevate the taste and take your drink to a whole new level. Your guests will be talking about these for years. Okay, let's get our mise en place ready. Let's make the simple syrup first. It's really just equal parts of water and equal parts of sugar. Turn our heat on to high. We'll add two cups of water. And we'll add two cups of sugar. Bring the water up to a boil to dissolve all the sugar. It has to cool down before we start using it. And the best way to do that, in my opinion, is to take a mason jar, put your simple syrup in it, stick it in the freezer, and wait about an hour. All our sugar is dissolved, we now have a simple syrup. Turn the heat off, now we'll just pour our simple syrup right into the mason jar. Okay, we have our simple syrup, and this is going to go into the deep freeze for about an hour to cool down. You don't have to worry about doing your own pomegranate seeds or anything like that. For grenadine, just go out and get some palm, pomegranate juice. Uh, it's a 100% pomegranate juice. There's not a lot of seeds to deal with. It's just easy. What we're going to do is a half a cup to a half a cup. Once again, it's the same process as when you made your simple syrup. You just want to heat it up until the sugar melts. And our grenadine is made. We only made a little. I know you can buy it huge bottles at the grocery store, but why? It'll just go bad. We only want the amount that we're going to use. And we'll take our homemade grenadine, pour it in another mason jar. And this too is going into the freezer to cool down. Now we need the zests of the oranges and the lime. With your zester, prepare two tablespoons of lime zest. Take the lime. This will take about three limes. Okay, there's our lime zest. And we need about one tablespoon of orange zest. Finally, the juicing up the limes and the oranges, and what we have to do is peel our limes. We'll need about six to eight of these. We've got all our limes peeled. Time for the oranges. They're done the same way. Cut the orange down the middle. Make it quarters. I find that if I quarter them, I can peel the skin right off. And we are going to use these in the juicer. So you don't need to worry about any seeds or anything like that. And we mustn't forget our garnishes. And we want to use the best of the best. So we'll take a lime, cut it in half, and then we just want little wedges. Same thing all over again. This time you want them a little thicker, probably about half an inch. To make our juice, you want to run your juicer on the lowest setting. That way it will extract the most juice from your limes and your lemons. So we'll turn on the juicer.
And there's the juice for our margarita mix. One of the things that a lot of people do with their margarita is salt the rim. I'm not gonna do that just to keep the sodium down. First thing for our margarita, we wanna add about a tablespoon of simple syrup. We add about five ounces of margarita mix, one ounce of tequila, half a teaspoon of lime zest, and a quarter of a teaspoon of orange zest. Stir it all up really good. Get my margarita glass. Use my fork to hold back the ice. And there we have perfect margarita. I'll tell you how good it is in just a second. Wow. The lime, the orange, really good. For our tequila sunrise, a lot of it is orange juice. First thing, one ounce of tequila, about five ounces of orange juice, and our homemade grenadine will pour over a spoon. And there is our tequila sunrise. To make our screwdriver, one ounce of vodka, a very small pinch of kosher salt, and some more orange juice. Give it a stir, a wedge of orange, and there you have the screwdriver. The salt actually takes out some of the acidity of the orange. If you like this video, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more of these, please subscribe. In fact, if there's something you would like to see in particular, please leave me a comment. I'd love to hear from you. Thank you for watching. I look forward to helping you eat healthier, shop smarter, and cook better.